A Mississippi National Guardsman who suffered a severe heat stroke while training in triple digit temperatures at Camp Shelby is on his way to recovery. 12 News' Brandon Rain spoke with Kobe Murray Wright's father, who says his son has come a long way since waking up from a coma. Colby Murray Rice, a guardsman from Hattiesburg, is taking his first steps since having a major heat stroke at Camp Shelby in August. His progress is no less short of a miracle. He's doing much better. He no longer has dialysis. His kidneys are working at, at 97%. He no longer has a breathing apparatus. His lungs are working. Uh, he no longer has a feeding tube. The 18-year-old was in a coma for 57 days due to brain and kidney damage. His family says it was an emotional moment seeing him wake up. And I said to him, say, Daddy. And he said, Daddy. And I said, what? And I said, what? Say, Kobe. He said, Kobe. I said, can you see me? I said, I'm holding a white cup. What color? He says, white. Rice's dad says he's quickly regaining his memory and strength. Rice is currently attending physical therapy at Oshner's Hospital in New Orleans. I'm going through that rehab, and it's extensive rehab. His arms, his legs, his neck, uh, getting his neck muscles in shape. And uh, it, it, it's, it's going for it, and we're very excited about it. Treatments will cost thousands of dollars. So students at Rice's alma mater, Sacred Heart, decided to help. We decided to organize a free dress fundraiser for $20 for four days. And we raised an amazing amount of money. We raised over $10,000 for him and his family and their medical bills. And um, we were so glad to be able to help them. Rice's family says they're thankful for the community's support. I would like to thank everyone that prayed for him, but specifically my friends and my family, I consider them my family, at Sacred Heart Catholic School. Rice's dad says he hopes to have Colby home for Thanksgiving. Reporting in Hattiesburg, Brandon Rains, 12 News.